Welcome to Grumpy Man's Reviews. Today we're looking at the Pretty Care W100 Cordless Vacuum Cleaner. This was very kindly sent to me by Pretty Care. They were kind enough to give me a discount code. I will leave a link to the cleaner and the discount code in the description box below. The discount code is only available for a limited time. So if you are interested in picking this up, I suggest you act fast. I'll take everything out of the box and then we'll go to what's included. And of course, I will also do a demonstration. Before I do that, remember, if you find the video useful, a like would be appreciated. Any questions, ask me in the comment section below and subscribe to watch more reviews. The first thing out of the box, some paperwork, an instruction manual, some information on how to contact them. And you do get five years warranty with this. That's a bit of a shock. Normally you get two years. It says here, congrats, you are lucky. Just letting you know, claim your free gift. You could either get a battery, that would be useful. It does have a removable battery, this, or a spare filter, but they've included another filter in. So anyway, that's the information there. There's a decent size crevice tool included, a two-in-one tool, dusting brush slash upholstery tool does have a litter picker there. And these tools can be fitted directly onto the cleaner. It's a click fit system. So put it on, push that to remove it, or they could be fitted on at the end of the wand. And click that to remove them. Some mounting hardware. A spare filter. It's got one in the cleaner and they've given another spare one which is good so if you wash the other one you have one to use a charger because i'm in the uk mine is a three pin one this is the removable battery the battery gives you a run time of 35 minutes that depends what mode you're in as you can see there that's on off and it's got a plus and a minus the plus of course is a boost mode it's a 2,600 milliamp hour battery. I like that the battery is removable. So you could either charge the battery by itself or you could charge it while it's on the cleaner. And there's the port for it. You just push that in there and plug that into your mains. The floor nozzle, it does have a flexible pipe there. At the front, it's got five LEDs. LEDs are really helpful in cleaning. At the bottom, it's got two little wheels, a felt strip there. And the blue ones are really soft and the red ones are fairly soft as well. So the floor head is safe to use on hardwood and of course on, on carpets. To give this a further clean, you could see there's a lock on lock off there. So you'd push that, the brush bar comes out, cut hair off and stuff. It would only go in one way two big wheels there. The main unit, it's got some pretty care branding there. From the top, it looks like a coffee machine. The handle, the back, that's where the battery would go. The battery would only go in one way. You can see it's got connector points there. And in there, it's got connector points as well. So you match them up and just push it in. That little button there, that's to remove the battery so you'd push that down and pull the battery to remove it, Let's install it. Oops. That's a little screw in there and that is the charging port. So if you wanted to charge the battery while it's in the cleaner, you'd just put the charger in there. And I think it takes around three and a half to four hours to fully charge. Actually, when I turned it on, a blue light came on at the top. Yeah. That looks quite cool, that. At the bottom, it's got an information sticker there. That latch there is to empty the bin. And the tools, as I showed you before, would fit on the front and the extension pole would fit on there as well. I don't know if you'll be able to see this if I turn it that side, yeah. It's got a lock on and a lock off. So to access the filters or to further clean the bin, you just twist it and that comes apart. 
that's what it looks like from there. It's got a foam pad in there to keep it more secure. Anyway, to remove the filters, just twist and pull. That's the HEPA filter. You could wash that, but make sure it's completely dry before you put them back into the machine. And that mesh filter, you could wash that as well. To fit the HEPA filter back into the mesh filter, it's got little guides there, and this has got little cutouts there as well. So just push it and twist, and it's in place. Then put it into the bin. Yeah. To put the bin back on, you could see it's got a round sign and a padlock there, and on the bin it's got an arrow pointing up towards the little round part there. Just line it up and just twist and it's on securely. The extension one is aluminium and it does extend if you push this button there you get it to extend to different sizes. It locks into place. Really good that. And it would fit on only one way pushes on. And of course push that button to extend it and to remove it you'd push the little arrow sign on the actual cleaner and just pull it. The floor head can be fitted directly onto the hand unit like so or you could of course put it to the wand. And to remove that you'd push the arrow there to put it onto the cleaner something like so and that would go on there so you could do your stairs by putting the floor head directly onto the hand unit or you could do it like this if I just turn it on you'll be able to see the lights from the front see that spin that's boost mode I like the fact that it's got a clear window at the front, so when you get any hair caught up, you will be able to see it and then you could remove them. I've put down some tea and some cookies. I'm going to be leaving the cleaner in the normal mode. clean sweep there. I'll just pick this up and then we'll move over to the carpet. Onto the carpet, same thing, some tea and some cookies. Again, I'll be using the cleaner in the normal mode first and if I need to, I will then go on to the boost mode. But seeing its performance on the hard floor, I don't think I will need to go into boost mode, but let's see. Again, it's picked everything up. Just one or two little grains there, but it's done a really good job. I'll move over to the other side now, pick this up.
just thought I'll show you the bin. As you can see, it's picked everything up and even some carpet fibers are in there as well. Well, there you go. That was the Pretty Care W100 cordless vacuum cleaner. In my opinion, I think it's a really good cleaner. This build quality is good. You get five years guarantee. That is amazing. As far as I know, correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section. The only other manufacturer that gives you that long guarantee with the cordless cleaner is Shark. I really like the fact that the wand can be extended to a different size because this cleaner does not stand up by itself. So the only way to make it stand up by itself is you have to mount it to the wall with the hardware that they sent. But at this size, it could just stay on the floor because it's not large and it won't come in the way. I like the light at the top. One thing to mention, if you charge the battery in the cleaner, the light at the top flashes. I mean, it's fully charged, it will of course go off. But if you charge the battery by itself, there's no indication to know if the battery a is getting charged and b when it's fully charged that's the only complaint i've got regarding the battery it's not that heavy it's light so if you do have any uh, arthritis or anything it's a cleaner for you if you are interested in picking this up as i mentioned at the start of the video i do have a discount code but it's only for a limited time so i'll leave a link to the cleaner and the discount code in the description box below i hope this video was useful to someone if it was a like would be appreciated any questions, ask me in the comment section below. Subscribe to watch more reviews. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you all in my next video.